Amazon just announced Nova, which is their latest suite of new AI models exclusively available within Amazon Bedrock. Will these models beat out Claude and ChatGPT? Let's find out. Amazon just had their AWS reInvent conference where they announced Nova, the latest group of foundational AI models for enterprise customers and developers within the AWS ecosystem. These new AI models will be able to process text, images, and videos as prompts. However, one important thing to note is that these models are only available through Amazon Bedrock. If you're unfamiliar, Amazon Bedrock is a fully managed service from AWS that allows access to multiple models from a single API. So Amazon Bedrock contains AI models such as Claude, Llama 2, and now these latest Nova models. And because they're accessed through an API, these models are pay-as-you-go pricing. And through Bedrock, you're also within AWS's infrastructure, so you don't need to manage anything on your own, since AWS already provides enterprise security with built-in monitoring and governance. So basically any developer or business can integrate these latest Nova AI models directly into their applications and workflows within AWS's infrastructure. And unlike ChatGPT or Claude, which are more geared towards individual or personal use since they have their own web interface, you will need an AWS account to access these latest Nova models. With this trade-off though, you get more power and customization within the models, it just requires a bit more technical setup. Now, let's go over the capabilities of these new Nova AI models. They will be able to analyze complex documents and videos, understand charts and diagrams, generate engaging video content, and even build AI agents for your business. But the specific use case that you want will be dependent on the Nova model that you select. So here's a breakdown of all the Amazon Nova models that are available within Bedrock. The first is Amazon Nova Micro, which is a fast text-only model that is not multimodal. This has the lowest latency responses at a very low cost, so you can think of this as the budget model, and this will have a 128,000 token context window. Next is Amazon Nova Lite, which is the low-cost multimodal model that can handle images, videos, and text inputs. Following that, we have Amazon Nova Pro, which is a multimodal model with a combination of accuracy, speed, and cost for the most balanced yet capable model. And the Nova Lite and Nova Pro models both have a 300,000 token context window. Amazon also stated that the Nova Lite and Pro models can process up to 30 minutes of video analysis and support up to 200 languages. Then we have Amazon Nova Premier, which is the most capable Amazon multimodal model that can be used for complex reasoning tasks. Lastly, and just as an aside, Amazon also announced Nova Canvas and Nova Real, which are image and video generation models only. Now, let's go over the key benefits of these new Nova AI models. The biggest benefit with these new Nova models lie within its customization capabilities for enterprise customers. Because these models are available within Amazon Bedrock, you're able to fine tune these models to fit your exact need. What this means is that you can add your industry specific terminology, branding, and use case to work seamlessly with your business. Basically, these Amazon models are incredibly capable, fast, and cost effective to work with your customer systems and data. In fact, the Nova Lite, Micro, and Pro are 75% less expensive than the best performing models within the space. Amazon hasn't yet released specific pricing figures, however there are claims that Nova Micro matches or exceeds Google Gemini's 1.5 model and Nova Pro is comparable to GPT-40. And these models will be based on a pay-as-you-go structure, meaning no upfront commitment. But like I mentioned, the enterprise features will be the main star of the show for these new Nova models. So there will be built-in safety controls, digital watermarking, and it'll work seamlessly with AWS services like Amazon Bedrock Knowledge Bases for information retrieval or Amazon Bedrock Agents for automated workflows. Plus, you'll get knowledge base support and custom model training with fine tuning. Now, if you do end up using these new Nova models, use cases can vary dramatically by industry. So legal firms can use document analysis, marketing firms can use content generation, customer service companies can use AI assistance, and then software development agencies can more so use code analysis use cases. So all of these custom use cases can be great depending on the customer profile. However, the downsides of these new Nova models also lie within its benefits as well. There are technical requirements needed to fully utilize the strength of these Nova models. So at a minimum, you'll need basic AWS knowledge, 
API integration capabilities, and some level of programming experience will be helpful. I wouldn't compare the model usability to Claude or ChatGPT, since you do need to be fully integrated within Amazon Bedrock to use these models to their full potential, whereas Claude and ChatGPT are more so individual and personalized use. But let's compare the raw performance of these models because the results might just shock you. Looking at the performance chart here, we can see that even though Nova scores well within its class, Claude Sonnet 3.5 basically outperforms Nova Pro in every single category except for translation to languages and instruction following. So as of now, Claude Sonnet still beats Nova Pro in language understanding, general reasoning, common sense reasoning, deep reasoning, mathematics, Python code generation, and multi-step reasoning. So what this means is that even though Nova Pro is still very capable, Claude is beating it in general understanding, reasoning, and code generation capabilities. And the last thing to note here is that this benchmark test is comparing Nova Pro, not Nova Premier, which is the more capable of the two models. These new foundational models are very impressive in their own right, especially when it comes to custom training and tuning, but when it comes to just pure intelligence, Claude still reigns supreme. The main benefit I see with these new Nova models still lies within its AWS ecosystem integration. So if you currently do have a workflow that's integrated within AWS, these new Nova models are a complete game changer. And these new Nova models are currently available within specific AWS regions. So the Nova Micro, Lite, and Pro models are currently available in the US East and US West AWS regions. The Nova Premier model is targeting availability in early 2025. And the Nova Reel currently generates short videos, with plans to extend to two minute long videos in the coming months. So what do you think of this latest Nova model announcement from Amazon? Do you plan on integrating these models into your current workflow? And if you're wondering which model is best suited for coding as a complete beginner, then make sure to check out our program at AI Code Pathways. We offer the industry leading program to help any non-technical founder build any complex app that they can imagine. And we do this through a detailed AI coding coursework, an active community of AI builders that are there to help build alongside you, as well as a network of professional developers that can first explain code, even provide prompts and debug your project when AI fails or gets stuck because it isn't perfect. Our developers add a human touch to really bridge the gap and take your app to the finish line completely using AI. So click the link in our bio if you're interested in building as it's never been easier as a non-technical founder. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more weekly content covering everything AI and coding related, and let us know what you'd like to see next. And until then, don't stop building with these AI tools.